This is likely the biggest spider I've ever found. Meet the white banded fishing spider. Although it looks like it's from Australia, it can actually be found in most of the eastern United States and southwest of Texas. Out of the eight species of fishing spider that occur in the U.S., the white banded has its own unique characteristics. Its name is a reference to the band of white hairs often seen right below its eyes. They usually sport camouflage-friendly colors such as tan, olive green, or brown, which helps in catching unsuspecting prey and protects them from predators. These colorations are important since they prefer to spend time outside of water. They can especially be found on trees or other vertical surfaces in moist forested areas or wetlands. Unlike other fishing spiders, the white banded's head is also more elevated on its body. This fuzzy spider still has the water repelling hairs that all other fishing spiders have, however it prefers to hunt insects or other animals on land. Fishing spiders in general are very important predators in aquatic ecosystems, and the white banded helps protect trees in these areas by preying on insects that cause tree damage or defoliation. Like other fishing spiders, this one will use webbing only for their egg sacs, which they carry around in their fangs. Hundreds of spiderlings hatch in spring, which go on to mature by summer. This is a big spider, but it's not really dangerous unless you were allergic to its bite. It can cause localized pain and swelling. This spider would likely hide under tree bark, run away, or escape to nearby water before even trying to bite. Thanks for watching! If you want to learn more about fishing spiders, click here to check out my fishing spider documentary. Stay tuned for more peeks at wildlife!